All right, fun fact. I am actually an extra in the very first Harry Potter movie. You can see me when Hermione is going home for Christmas. She's walking through the hallway into the Great Hall, and I walk past. A ghost walks through me. I'm holding a, an owl, um, and I'm in a Ravenclaw, you know, robe. So, yeah, we shot that for three months. It was a lot of fun. The only time my sister Julianne ever beat me in a ballroom Latin competition uh, was in Vegas, and she never lives that down. She she loved the fact that she beat me because she she never did, and and except for on Dancing with the Stars, she she beat me in uh, season four and season five where she went back to back, but that was, that was it. So yeah, she beat me once. For John Mayer's very first solo tour, um, I snuck into his dressing room at the Shepherd's Bush Empire and um, got kicked out like several times because I kept sneaking back in and saying that I was a guitar tech. Um, how they believed me, I was like 15 years old, I have no idea. But later I actually ended up meeting John Mayer and we were hanging out and I actually told him that story um, luckily, he wasn't too freaked out about it or um, weirded out by it, <laughs> but uh, yeah, classic. Okay, true story, I almost did a backflip onto Rod Stewart's head in front of the Queen of England um, on the Mall in front of Buckingham Palace. I did a round off back layout and he walks in front of me where he wasn't supposed to be there and luckily I billed before I landed on him and possibly injured him severely in front of 70,000 people and the freaking queen. During Dancing with the Stars, um, in dress rehearsal, I was dancing with Kelly Pickler. It was the jive, we were dancing to Footloose, and I did this weird roll, and it just hurt my shoulder, and it's never really been the same ever since. There's always this sort of nagging, like, feeling that I have. Um, so yeah, so I carry a piece of Kelly Pickler with me, always. <laughs> So growing up, I mean, I have four sisters. I'm the only boy, so all my hand-me-down clothes were girl clothes. Um, and so I, what I used to do is if they had pink in them, I would just take a Sharpie and I would color it in black and hope, hope that nobody would notice that I was wearing, you know, girl clothes. And I didn't realize this as well, but the buttons were on the other side. So I'd put some jeans on or put like a jacket on and, and the buttons would be on the other side. And I just thought it was like a, a, a fashion thing. But no, female and male clothes are buttons are on different clothes, so yeah, I had uh, hand-me-down clothes for my sisters. My girlfriend and I actually rescued one of our cats, Paolo, out of the gutter the night of the Emmy Awards. Um, I saw this little kitten go across the street, told Haley, and before I could say anything, she was out of the moving vehicle doing a Tom Cruise run in her beautiful gown, and we are on our hands and knees in the gutter. I was in a tux trying to get this little cat out, and after about an hour, we finally got him out, washed him up, covered in fleas, and now he, uh, he runs the house. This is his house and we're all lucky to live in it. My mom used to live in Las Vegas for about 20 years and I used to go there all the time as a kid and dream about having my own show. And now I do with my residency at the Venetian Hotel that starts in September, so pretty cool.